Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. Now at 5 a.m., the juries get the cases. Two local cases, uh, pro high-profile cases, could be decided today, including the trial of a former UCLA gynecologist accused of sexually abusing several patients. Plus, deadly fentanyl disguised as candy. The warning for parents is trick-or-treating and other big Halloween events get underway. And after nearly three years of COVID protections, L.A. landlords will soon be able to evict tenants who are not paying their rent. Good morning. It's Wednesday. I'm Leslie Sykes, along with John Gregory and Rachel Brown. And some of us have our fall colors on. Yeah. Rachel went fall. I went fall. I went fall. And Sykes is still in summer mode. Summer. What's going on, Sykes? This is dark. All right. Well... Uh, you know, <laughs> when you wake up and it's dark, I can just grab whatever. Hey, Les <laughs> Leslie Lopez has gone fall. She's totally too. fall. <laughs> I gone, I've gone fall. Yeah, that's right. Exactly. Uh, well, it's the only thing that fits. Yeah. <laughs> Still trying to get through the closet stuff. Yeah. Good morning. This is what it looks like today. We're back to temperatures that are going to be hovering, uh, you know, into the 60s and some 70s out there this morning. A little bit of cloud coverage out there and some of the clouds that we're seeing.